FNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. And currently, about a slightly mixed bag out here. The only indice, only indice trading to the downside is the NDX 100. It's up 11 points. The uh, Dow is up 21. S&P is up 2. Russell's up 12. Semis are up 2 points. Trend is up 230. Uh, UPS having a big day up 28 points, 14% to the upside out there. You've got gold trading out at uh, 1802.30, up $7.30. Silver up 25 Cents trading at 2265, and the 30 year treasury is down at 15509. That is off 11 ticks. Let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart. We begin by taking a look at the ES mini. Here's what we know we know that price is trading above the center of its bullish structure daily profile. That suggests that price should target the top of that daily profile, and that's at the 4582 area. No, I'm sorry, not 4582, that's at 4625. However, before price can get there, it's got to deal with its weekly profile. Remember, last week we had price close below. In fact, I think we might have two consecutive weeks inside the ES Mini below the bottom of its weekly profile. And that's where we get that change in trend signal. So 45.49 should be a key resistance level. Now, if price can get through that, it could make its way up. Counter trend moves when you break below a the bottom of a bullish structured profile. The counter trend move will end at typically either the bottom or what I find more often than not is the center. That center level is at 46.46. Now, as long as that spot volatility continues, continues to move lower, it's still above the 50-day exponential moving average, it's likely targeting that level of 22.26. But if, in fact, price is able to close, the spot fix that is, below 22.26, then that should make a run for the lower Bollinger Band that I've got out there at 17.63. And that should keep the ES Mini or the S&P continuing to move higher. If we take a look at the NQ right now, it's dealing with resistance. The resistance level is the top of its profile. That's at 14.874. We're trading at 14.906 right now so price is trading above that there is a new weekly profile that is formed now this is above price this profile will not be confirmed until sunday but at 102 in the afternoon it is a valid profile and this suggests resistance is in between the range of 15182 to 15478 us dollar index has got a td9 count top anytime you get a topping signal that just suggests that price should pull back and test support that's exactly what the U.S. dollar index has done. As long as price holds 96.26, basically the signal is neutral. Gold testing and rejecting the bottom of its profile. That's not what uh, gold wants to see, nor silver. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Z Show. We'll be back in just a few. If you're off to start through Tuesday, have a trip.